Hi everyone. It is 4th of July weekend and man is it hot. Um, so I'm sitting in the shade here and uh, by the ladies coop and you know the holidays get me thinking about delicious food and nice cold drinks and I thought it'd be a good time to tell you about what chickens like to eat. Um, since I haven't discussed that really yet. Um, chickens are omnivores, so they eat everything, um, meat and plants and greens. Um, and really when they start off small, like little chicks, they're gonna eat a food. It's in a little dish like this. This is what you start a chicken off on. It's a chick feed and you buy it from a you know, a feed mill or a store like Farm and Fleet, just little little pellets, little crumble actually, because it's easier for chicks to digest. Um, you can get medicated or non-medicated, but I do non-medicated, because we're going for a more natural approach. But this is what the chickens eat as their basic food. And now that they're older, once the ladies are laying eggs, then we'll put them on what's called a layer feed. Um, it has more calcium and nutrients in it that helps them with the production of eggs. Um, they're not quite to that point yet, but they're getting there. Uh, and of course, when they're free ranging, they're free to eat whatever they like. So they'll eat grass and weeds and you know flowers and of course bugs. They love ticks and grasshoppers and moths. And so they're getting a really rich diet, um, really good variety. Um, chickens also love fruit and um, so that's good for them too and and sometimes I'll give them like a head of lettuce to play with and eat up and you don't want to give them treats too early you want to make sure that they've had their feathers fully established and they're you know a good 13 14 weeks old before you get them off the chick feed and start giving them these extra things um, the ladies of course are still eating the chick food um, as that's their main diet along with everything else they're getting when they're free ranging. So, um, yeah, and another great food that chicks love, or chickens love, is called scratch. And this is like candy for chickens. It's, it's seeds and nuts and corn pieces, and this is something that you don't give them every day. Um, it's a great training tool to get them to come back to the coop, but it's, it's really fattening. It isn't the right kind of um, nutrients that they need to grow. So you don't want to focus on that. It's just, it's a special treat. It's to get them come, to come running. And so that's called chicken scratch. So this right here is what chicken scratch looks like. And you can see there's sunflower seeds and kernels and pieces of corn and it's a little salty. And um, sometimes there's like cranberries and raisins in it. So that is a real special treat for the chickens and they love it. And sometimes I'll mix it in and sprinkle it on their food uh, in the morning when I'm training them or talking to them just to get them to know that, oh, mom, mom's special. She's the one that brings us the treats. And, and so that establishes a nice trust with the ladies. Uh, and you can hear <laughs> Lazy's right there talking to me because she knows I have the treat bucket out. <laughs> so there she is in the coop. And since it's a hot day, we're going to give them all a special treat to eat and enjoy in just a moment. Stop. All right, so we are going to give the ladies a special treat on a hot day. They are going to get a watermelon rind with a little bit of watermelon left in it. Teddy here is going to stick it in the coop for them. So let's open it up, Ted. You walk in gently. Go set it down for the ladies there. Ow. Set it down. There's ladies enjoying their watermelon on a hot day. Yeah, you ladies like that watermelon? Tastes real good and gives them something fun to do. Yeah, hi galaxy. 
here. It's gotten real big, you can see. <laughs> Pretty soon we'll have some layers on our hands, won't we, girls? Yeah. You can see Galaxy there. She's just scraping her beak. That's something chickens do when the food gets a little stuck. It's kind of like brushing your teeth. <laughs> they scrape their beaks off. Well, I hope you all are staying cool. Maybe you enjoyed some watermelon this weekend too. I hope you all had a great fourth. And that you remember to keep calm and love chickens. And we'll talk to you soon.